Hi guys, this is Dr. Akshay. I am a resident oncologist and in the last video we discussed some superfoods and those superfoods help increase longevity, they are antioxidants and they also prevent cancer. But in this video we are going to discuss why those superfoods or supplementation should not be given to the patient who are already diagnosed with cancer and are receiving radiation or chemotherapy. So basically both radiation and some of the chemotherapeutic agents they have an indirect action on DNA by the mechanism of free radical generations. So let us first understand how radiation and some of the chemotherapeutic agents work. So one of their action is indirect killing of the DNA of the tumor cells. Now this indirect killing occurs because of the generation of free radicals by the help of radiation therapy and few chemotherapeutic agents like bleomycin. And obviously when these free radicals are generated, they help kill the tumor DNA and moreover the tumor cells. Now the problem in this case with the superfoods we discussed is that they are packed with antioxidants. For example, broccoli is very rich in glutathione and glutathione is one of the strongest antioxidants. So that glutathione will neutralize the free radical which is meant to kill the tumor cell but it would rather neutralize it and the tumor killing would suffer. And theoretically, we can also say that there will be less response to chemotherapy or radiation therapy. Now, two of the most reputed references for cancer are NCCN and ASCO. They both recommend to limiting these antioxidant rich foods. You can obviously take a normal diet with them, but do not never ever supplement them. Do not supplement with vitamin C, vitamin E, selenium or any strong glutathione like antioxidants.